Hello guys and welcome to another welcome to another quick video about Dezora and how to fix um, a couple of problems. This is mainly on the um, fit force update or restart thing. Now ma many people have contacted me and and said oh, I keep getting this error. Would you help me out? Stuff like that. Um, of course, I didn't know the solution, but um, Dave, an admin from um, Dezora, kindly put up a comment on the video um, saying what things you can do. To uh to fix it, and I'm just quickly gonna go over that because I don't know how many people read the comments or 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 can be bothered to read, or well, maybe they don't know how to read. You know, maybe that's why you watch YouTube videos. Maybe you don't know how to read. But basically, if you go into the Dezora application, wherever you've installed it onto, so obviously this is on my C drive, and a way to get this error from stop working is if you uh if you highlight all of this. Delete it all. I mean, get rid of it all. Delete it, and then run the Dezora application. Then that will do a fresh install. You'll still have all your games and stuff like that. Don't delete your common thing because if not, you lose your games as well, and then you have to reinstall them and stuff like that. So keep the thing in there. <coughs> uh, another method is to. Um, Is oh sorry I just recorded this but yeah my head's just gone because what happened was that um, my email showed up and I don't really want people spam spamming my email uh, because I put up a comment on this video saying you know why I had shit what this person said uh, it's because I've got six gig RAM and i5 processor this game wasn't performing very well. Um, this guy said, oh, it's not, it's, it's not the game's fault, it's your computer's fault, which I don't know how, you know, I'm getting over it, but it's absolutely pathetic, and I'm an I, I'm a level 3 IT student, I know what the fuck I'm talking about, okay? So, you can go die, and stuff like that. So, obviously, if this doesn't work, you can do a fresh install by, you know, using the installer here, stuff like that. Uh, but if you also think that um, a game is causing the problem, your last modification that you did, Say you installed, um, say the last game that I installed was Open Bra, and and then the game and then it broke. Um, basically, each one of these games should have an uninstaller down towards the bottom, and use that uninstall the game. See if it works. If it doesn't work, you know you can put you can put the game back on, or you can. Of course, if if that doesn't work and you can't figure out why the error is coming up, I would recommend that you contact support. Uh, this is the link here, so obviously you type in your email, so google at gmail.com Yeah, I'm original right now, don't think of me that much. And then obviously you can type in, you know, force update. And and they should get back to you within a week. Obviously, Dezora isn't as big as Steam and stuff like that, so you probably won't get, you know, it back within, you know, an hour. You won't get, you know, they they... they you know, they make sure that they've got the correct information for you. They give you a link to a website which really helps you. And then hopefully you'll be able to, uh, hopefully they'll be able to fix the problem for you. Of course, um, if none of the stuff is working, you can still, you can still install games as long as the store application is installed. It doesn't necessarily have to be working, but as long as it's installed, then you can access all your games via the common. And then basically you just go onto here and say I want um, a United. No, that's a group. I wanted a game, but you know, uh, let's let's find a game. There we go. Jo say I wanted Jolly Rover. Then is this a free game? Well, the demo is free. And then you can install game from here. And then that will put it straight into your common folder where you can access it and run the application from there. Stuff like that. Obviously you need a login for installing games. Um, stuff like that. I would recommend anyone to sign up for Dezora. Dezora is a great way. It's, it, it allows young developers, you know, companies who aren't so big, you know, who aren't EA, who aren't Ubisoft, Infinity Ward, stuff like that, you know, who are nice, it gives them a chance and stuff like that. That's why I like Dezora because you get some brilliant games, and, that, and that's what makes this thing so. Because it, there's basically a game is added like every day. A game is added every single day onto this site, and basically, it 
it means that you get a variety of games, you're not just going constantly for the FPSs, the big name companies, stuff like that. Because you get disappointed with the big names after all. I'm starting to get disappointed with Call of Duty. It's getting so repetitive. Oh, a guy, one guy and his friend are able to kill 500 people on a map, on their own, with 64 bullets and an AK and a bazooka with a with no ammo in it. Yeah, that makes a fuckload of sense. But it's just that it's not very good and also you can't see your fucking feet. Yeah, well done. Well done. Because basically their logic is that you can't go further, you can't lean your gun down and see your feet. Um, I think you can do that with a pistol though. I think I might actually get done with this and actually uh, play it. That's like a good idea. It looks a bit... Oh, look at that bulldog. So that's basically it. Hopefully I'll give you all the information. If I forgot anything, then um, you can always look back on my old video. Um, and stuff like that. I have to give Dave a real big thank you for um, assisting me and uh, telling me the uh, telling me some solutions to the problem. Obviously, sometimes you know solutions don't always work. It, that's what it's like in computing. You know, sometimes fixes don't work, patches don't work. You know, games breaks and stuff. Software is incompatible. Stuff like that. There's you always have with IT. You always have to you know you have to work from the um, typical side of things and then you have to work out and then like if say if, if I give the example of a mouse not working you know you probably think oh you know the USB cable has gone the laser has gone but what happens if it's something else what happens if it's the USB drivers that are out of dated and stuff like that so you know fixes don't always work that's what I'm trying to say um, but hopefully this video has helped you um, hopefully my voice is you know nice and loud and stuff I apologise, you know, I'm using an inbuilt mic onto a laptop, um, so, you know, quality is never the best, but hopefully you can understand me, you can understand what I'm saying, I, you know, I don't really care, like, pe people have, people keep asking me to get off YouTube because apparently I don't upload quality videos, I don't care, the more you tell me to get off, the more determined I'm going to be to fucking keep playing, I'm sorry, I've sort of, like, raved on a bit, but, I'm Major Smurf, um, <clears throat> this is the uh, this is the end of this video of um, how to fix the um, force update and restart thing. Um, I just want to say another big thank you to Dave. Thanks, Dave. Um, not not Dave is in the channel. Dave is in the admin for Dizora. Don't don't go into you know I, I, I don't know if Dave's got a website. Let's have a look. Let's have a quick look. I don't think, I don't think Dave's got a website. Maybe they do. No, they don't. Uh, yeah. <laughs> but um, thanks for every thanks for um, all the comments. You know, I have tried to help you out, but hopefully this will help you out a bit more. And la di da di da. I'm gonna end it just there before I keep babbling on about shit and gobbledygook. So cheers, guys. Thanks for listening. Uh, and I stick my middle finger up to anyone who uh, asks any questions.